What's up guys, uh, it's Josh here today and I'm going to be talking to y'all about how to recondition a automotive battery. I'm using the battery off of my ATV. Um, everything you'll need for this is a thing of Epsom salt and a thing of distilled water. Make sure it is distilled so don't just go get it out of the sink or something and then you'll need a, a battery charger and then of course all the measuring tools to get the right measurements on the Epsom salt and distilled water. So basically the distilled water you want a quart of distilled water so I've got this pot here and I'm going to put a quart in. Alright, so we have a quart of distilled water. I'm going to put that on the stove right behind me and get it up to boiling. So while that's happening, I'm going to get my Epsom salt ready. You're going to need 10 tablespoons of Epsom salt. Let me grab that. Got my tablespoon, and if you do a little bit too much, it's not going to hurt anything. It's probably better that you do too much rather than too little. One. We'll put a little bit extra in there. So we've got our 10 tablespoons of Epsom salt right here. I'm gonna wait for this to start boiling and we'll pour the Epsom salt in and let it get good and dissolved. And to prepare the battery for the Epsom salt, you need to take this little cap off right here. Looks like this, so you can look down into the cells of the battery and that's where you'll pour the Epsom salt down into. So when this gets to boiling, uh, I'll come back and we'll finish the battery. Distilled water is now boiling. I'm just going to take the Epsom salt and pour it in while it's still boiling. And then I'm going to stir the water solution and wait for it all to dissolve. And when it's completely dissolved, it should be like a milky color. And then we'll go from there. Alright, so our Epsom salt solution is completely dissolved. So I'm going to bring it over here. And take a, I have a funnel right here. I'm just going to stick it in one of the things. And I'm going to get a cup to pour this with. Because if I pour that whole pot, I will probably spill it. When you're pouring it, you just got to look down in there and you can see little metal grates that it looks like. And you barely just want to cover those. You're going to take your cap, put it back on, make sure that all of them go in correctly and all the way down, otherwise it will pour out later on, and then shake it up. Just mixing the acid and the Epsom salt. I 
I would recommend wearing safety glasses when you do this, but I'm not doing it. Alright, then you're going to take your battery charger and charge this battery for 24 hours and then you should be good to go. This will work on most batteries unless your battery is extremely old and completely dead. But other than that, I hope this helps you. Uh, please like this video, subscribe, and we'll see you next time.